A 12-year-old boy is fighting for his life. He contracted a rare and often fatal infection that is attacking and eating his brain. Doctors blame a microscopic organism, and right now he's being treated in the ICU at Miami Children's Hospital. We just like, oh, he just got a virus, you know, he just got one of them 24-hour viruses. Zachary Reyna spent August 3rd kneeboarding in a ditch by his house. Nothing unusual. He slept all day, all night. And then that's when my mom was like, okay, you know, something's not right. Sleeping this much was unusual for this active and healthy seventh grader. It just was happening really quick. His brother Brandon Villarreal says one second Zach was playing, the next he was undergoing brain surgery, diagnosed with primary amoebic meningoencephalitis, or PAM. It's just tough to see him like this, you know. I wish I could just touch him and it would transfer over or something, or, you know. It, don't work like that. It's caused by an amoeba found in still warm water. It traveled up Zach's nose and into his brain. He's fighting. He's strong. He's really, really strong. Zach is in ICU at Miami Children's Hospital. His family keeping vigil at his bedside. My mom would just be like, hey, you got to take the trash out, Zach. And she'd tell him three or four times, mom, I got this. I'll do it. You know, and it's just, and we, we, we can see him now, you know, as we're praying for him, him just saying, hey, I, I got this, you know. Only three people have ever survived this deadly infection. He can be number four, you know. So that's what we're hoping. We're hoping for him to be number four. The family is staying positive, telling their young baseball player to never give up in this close game. I told him it's the ninth inning. <laughs> ninth inning, two outs. You know, runner on third. It's, he's up to bat. You know, it's his turn to hit it out. Bring them runs home so we can go home. You know, it's time to win. He's going to be okay. We sure hope so. Zachary, not alone in this fight. A 12 year old Arkansas girl was also infected with the same rare brain eating parasite a couple of weeks ago and has been moved out of the ICU. Her condition has been upgraded to FAIR.